The Alice Chalmers HD15, one of the last GM powered track type tractors offered by Alice Chalmers. The HD15 was also a top performer and paved the way for the subsequent model HD16. Preserved Alice Chalmers HD15 working at a US machinery show open day. The straight blade was made by Baker and is original, but the rear cable control has been replaced by a more reliable Caterpillar number 25. Nice to see these old girls preserved. Photographed near Tai Happy in 1972, one of Taylor and Cully's Alice Chalmers HD15s takes a break during the realignment of State Highway 1. The dozer blade and nose cone are made by Garwood and the rear PCU was built by Superior. In 1958, on what is now the main runway at Wellington Airport, one of Taylor and Cully's Alice Chalmers HD15s takes a smoko break. As can be seen, the blade and nose cone are of Garwood origin and it has a superior PCU on the rear. It is towing a 50 ton proof roller. As a matter of interest, the tail end of the scraper bowl in the left of the image belongs to a very rear Alice Chalmers TS200. New Zealand Roadmakers Alice Chalmers HD15 towing an early 2D series Caterpillar No. 80 scraper on a construction job somewhere in Auckland during the 1950s. Neither tractor nor scraper were very old when this image was taken, and the HD15 is not equipped for any form of blade equipment. The Salus Chalmers HD15 sat alongside State Highway 1 near Rata for a number of years in the company of an international TD24 and Euclid 16 TDT before they were all removed sometime in the 1990s. Note that the blade equipment on this tractor is a Baker copy of its Le Tonneau design. Somebody has welded a large guard plate to protect the radiator. Not the most flattering photo, but old number 61 is an Alice Chalmers HD15 which once belonged to H. Allen Mills of Rotorua and was used in forestry operations before being retired. It was traded into Clyde Engineering, where it was photographed, on some new Terex equipment in the early 1970s. Lying derelict at a used equipment dealer's yard in the USA is this Alice Chalmers HD15 outfitted with a Garwood nose cone and angle blade frame. It is hoped that it evaded the scrapper's torch. Amidst the dust of a central North Island road building job, this Alice Chalmers HD15 with Garwood nose cone tows a Le Tonneau model LP carrier scraper sometime in the mid 1950s. The operator appears happy enough with his lot. Another preserved HD15 which is awaiting full restoration in the USA. It is equipped with a Baker blade and nose cone. Alice Car Chalmers did not begin to build their own attachments until 1955, the year the HD-15's replacement, the HD-16, was introduced. Kiwi Ingenuity or Frankenstein's monster, you be the judge. This war-weary Alice Chalmers HD-15 was converted to a self-propelled compactor by Taylor and Cully and photographed at a subdivision housing site in Kelson, Wellington in 1972. Readers be warned, there was also a similar HD-16 conversion as well 